Rexes. Hello friends, today we'll be discussing how to make Rexes in a case where you have a calcified capsule. So after staining the capsule with blue dye, you can see there are folds on the anterior capsule. Uh, once I entered my cystitome through the side port, uh, I tried to make a nick but it was very hard. You can see the anterior calcified capsule and you don't want to stretch too much as uh, that might cause a bit of zonular weakness. So I couldn't find any place where I could make a rexus. So luckily I found one part where the capsule was not calcified. I slowly took that capsule, that part and started making my rexus. Uh, though my Rex's size was a bit small, um, I tried making it. Later you can extend it anytime. Uh, at this part I was uh, a bit, I had to struggle a bit because uh, the capsule was very much calcified and I could not do my Rex's further. So I tried extending it with my cystitome but I had a really hard time. So then I slowly took out my cystitome, uh, inserted uh, some visco and after inserting visco I took my micro scissors, entered through the main port and started make cutting the calcified capsule. Uh, I used these micro forceps uh, in such a way that uh, it's naturally being converted into a rexus. So uh, then I entered to the side port and started extending the rexus. Uh, you'll have to be very careful because at times that rexus can extend to the periphery and can also cause uh, a posterior capsular rent. So make sure you use a lot of visco, uh, you maintain the anterior chamber and uh, you can use a little visco beneath the capsule now i entered uh, through the sideboard i used my micro scissors to increase the size and the length of the rexes uh, you have to be slow you have to be very careful uh, make sure you don't extend the rexes to the periphery you need a good round circular five millimeter rexes and uh, then again i started using visco in the anterior chamber so that uh, the ac is well maintained so once uh, you have maintained the ac now i brought in my micro forceps to a side port these two instruments are very important one are the micro scissors and the micro forceps always keep them by your side you can need them anytime so i held the uh, entry capsule flap and started increasing the size of the rexus my initial rexus was a bit small so i had to do spiral rexus uh, to increase the size of the rexus so i used my micro forceps for that and then uh, once i uh, finished using the micro forceps put a little visco in the anterior chamber to make it well formed then i bought in my cystitome actually i'm a bit comfortable with my cystitome for making rexes so i continued making the spiral rexes uh, with the help of my cystitome and i got a uh, five uh, millimeter size rexes the important part uh, in this case is uh, make sure you don't uh, handle the anterior capsule too much so that you don't get uh, you don't stress the zonules secondly be very careful as there may be a lot of extension of the anterior capsule to the periphery which can lead to a posterior capsular rent hope this uh, video was helpful and uh, thank you for watching